example number two of a happy home for Ag Venture Seed. I may mention the first field we were in, that has 300 bushel potential. There were sections of that farm last year that ran 300 bushels per acre. Now that uh, spring a year ago, much like the one this year, wasn't optimal for early planting. That was actually a late May planting. And so planting date is important to corn on uh, what your final yield potential is, but equally as important are the aspects that we teach in the maximum profit system of no matter what your planting date, plant into fit conditions, plant with perfection, take care of that crop, because even when you're a month off from your optimal planting date, high yields are still possible. Here's a great example in this field here. Again, same operator we were on uh, in section number one, different farm. And this was planted in late April. We're already at the um, leaf and a half stage uh, by the collar method here. And look at the flawless emergence of this, of this crop right here. If you are a farmer wanting to take your average production history from 225 to 245, or if you're an ag venture salesman working with a customer that you want to help him grow his business and become more productive, what a great place to start with optimal seed placement. And uh, the number one thing is first of all, you have to have a seed supplier folks that gives you high quality seed. And Ag Venture, uh, our salesmen, our, our Ag Venture yield specialists, our independent seed company owners can tell you a lot about how they go through painstaking process of choosing seed lots that meet not only industry standards, but their standards, Ag Venture standards that are higher than industry standards. And that's a great place to start when you want to have the picket row coming up evenly spaced, evenly emerged, that leads to full producing ears and higher yields on Ag Venture Farms. <laughs>